Hello and welcome to today. Today is quite a scary day, I think, because we've been told that we have another two weeks of lockdown. Um, we were about to finish 21 days next week, and now we're just starting 21 days. It's scary because you don't have any control. There is a good reason for it. In the world, hundreds and thousands, almost a million people have been infected, and that is a, an underestimate. And tens of thousands of people have died from COVID, and many have died from not having access to healthcare, which is why it is important that that we continue with this lockdown, even though it doesn't make sense right now. I want you to breathe, just breathe. You have no control over this. The only thing you do have control over is how do you treat others? How do you see others? And what will be your next step? Remember that one step at a time on a journey is going to get you somewhere, but we don't know where. So choose the road that you are going to, um, you are going to step on. If you step on the road of just denial, negativity, uh, blame, it's going to be a dark place and you're going to find yourself at a dead end. The world is rebooting. Think of a computer. Everything, and if you haven't saved your work, it's gone. But when it reboots, it's an opportunity for you to be able to start something new. Where, where is your mind now? How are you doing? Are you afraid? It's okay to be afraid. But what are you doing with that fear? What if you were the character of a, a movie and this was happening to you? How could you, how could you move yourself, move the character to become the best person they could be coming out of this? I believe in you. I believe that you have it in yourself to navigate this time. It's going to get it's going to get hard. You have resilience, but you have to, you have to make up your mind to do that. Today, uh, many Western Christians recognize today as, as Good Friday. Um, the first day of Easter, the day that, that Jesus died on the cross. And on that day, everyone thought it was over. The world was over. And then, two days later, he rose. So, we don't know what the future is holding. All we know is here and now. What choice are you going to make? Who are you going to reach out to? Who are you going to serve? What are you being called to serve? What skills do you have that your community needs? What can you do for the person next door? This is opportunity. Are you going to reach out and touch it? I'll see you tomorrow. I'm not going anywhere.